Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear viewers, today we will see how to use CSI Detail version 18 for ETAPS version 19. I will request all the viewers to watch the tutorials on YouTube from starting to the end. We are giving lots of effort to make tutorials, but most of the viewers are not watching the full tutorial. As a result, we are being frustrated. In this way, we will lose hope and maybe one day we will leave making tutorials and we may engage to another profession which will fulfill our satisfaction. So if you want us to make tutorials for you, please support us by watching full tutorial on YouTube. I hope this tutorial you will watch from starting to the end without skipping if you don't have free time please watch it later but watch it full on youtube so let's start first we will run it apps 19 version we will open the model which one we want to use for detailing for example this one open If the model is unlocked, then we will run the analysis. We will run the design. So after getting the design result, we can save the model and close it. Then we can run program csi detail v18 we will start with new from here open edb file this one all structural elements design we will open this one it will open with etaps version 18 as we have designed this file with etaps version 19 so it will not open with etaps version 18 click on ok so what we will have to do to open that file close this one go to option here settings browse it is in etaps 18 folder it was selected this one so we will go to etaps 19 folder then select this one open then click on ok now go to new detailing open edb file select this one open now it will open the file after opening the file it will import design result null frame will not be detailed so these are the warnings click on ok from here we can choose our settings for beams this is the design results okay this is the column result imported from the design file unit we can customize unit here we can customize preferences concrete detailing preferences for example for beam we can choose level prefix b for column c if there is any wall then only w click on ok concrete display preference beam we can see it has beam level in framing plan click on this ok river rules for beam preferred river size we can choose 16 and stir up 10 milli minimum spacing we can change it to 100 and maximum 300 like this stir up type we can change it to 135 degree and from here we can change cartelment rules 
long river section click on ok default drawing as we have not designed slab section here we will leave this unmarked beam column there is no share all so click on ok and other things we can customize from here river size drawing format text we can choose text font from here okay then at last we can click on okay so this is done here as we have not designed slab so it will not show any river it will show only framing plan we can go to beam details here framing plan stair top fourth floor here we can see b23 b24 by selecting that beam levels from etabs in our preference beam layout third floor second floor first floor and plinth beam schedule river schedule for beams river quantity elevation and section at a stair top level 6b1 this is the elevation this is the section reinforcement profile bill of materials river quantities river case from here you can see the river view fourth floor 5b3 this is the elevation this is the section a b c d e f in different zone river case from here to here the depth is smaller and from here to here the beam depth was larger we can see column framing plan schedule of column bill of materials river quantities and here elevation section this drawings we can export as dxf file or dwz file go to drawings export drawing dxf format start export So this is done. Open that folder. Here, the all the drawings exported. We can open this one. We can open other drawings also. We can open column section. C1. C1 elevation 2, C1 section A, C2, C3. We can see the detail viewer. The structure in 3D view with reverse, beam river, column rivers. This is the 6B202, 6B303, 6B606, 5B910, this one. In this way, we can view the structure with reverse. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more important upcoming tutorials. And if you have not subscribed the channel, please subscribe the channel. And if you feel the tutorials are very useful, please 
like the tutorials and share this with your friends and colleagues press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss another update